trailers, Jessica69 Live. <laughs> All right, you gotta have a 69 if you're doing some, um, you know, online pornography. Searching for potassium chloride. I believe that was one of them too, right? No, 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 potassium cyanide. Ah, the tricks, the tricks. What is going on, everybody? Welcome back to Need to Know. I'm your host, the Bergman known as Falcon. Honestly, I enjoyed the first one enough, and I think there was enough interest for a second video here to kind of give this a chance to maybe go into a series. I'm not really sure just yet. So here, I guess I'm with the family. This is Mama. I'm so happy we could finally get together for lunch. It's been so long. Mm-hmm. Alex, don't play with your food. I'm not playing, Mama. Meeting. Yeah, it's been hard to get away lately, Ava. The company's going gangbusters now. Not that I want to blow my own horn. Please, don't blow your own horn at the, uh, dinner table. Why not, honey? After all, it's your company. Alana, get off the f- Darn phone. Yes, mother. So anyway, long story short, I'm kicking ass and taking names over in Miami. <laughs> Sorry, looks like the investment boot has sailed, bro. I'll try to conceal myself, Steve. Um, may I be excused now? Already? Where are you going, mister? Over to Grant's, remember? Oh yes, well, make sure you're back before 10. So Selena, what's new with you? Any luck with this job hunting yet? With this job hunting yet? Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna get a job, Beery, I'm relaxed, alright? Well, I uh, yesterday there was, apparently I'm gonna get cut off no matter what I do. Actually, yeah, it's mom doing it. Actually, Selena had an interview just the other day with the Bureau of Statistics. That's like a very, like, mom that's really tuned in on what you're doing. Response there. Oh. Well, that's something, dear. Putting that four-year degree to good use, huh, champ? <laughs> I'm just messing with you. But if you're interested, I'm sure I can always find a spot in my company. Oh, yeah, this is the guy that, the, the guy that brags about everything in life. Oh, it's, it's going so good. It's going so good. I could probably get you a job where I work. Would you like that, buddy? Um, I'm apparently going to cut off again. Everybody's cutting me off. That's very generous, Steve, but I think this one looks promising. I don't know, Oscar. There's nothing wrong with a fallback, and it could really be a great opportunity. Right, Selena? Uh, I guess I'll see how the interview went. Third fastest growing information security firm in the Miami Dade area. All I'm saying is think about it, Chief. Gives you the wink. He probably gave me, like, the, the gun point, too. You know, the finger gun point and the wink. Scumbag. Did you hear that, Selena? Top three! Oh, take it easy, Mom. I'm just exploring the options. We know you'll be fine, sweetie. Yeah, thanks for the vote of confidence. Appreciate it. We got a, not a notification here. Please tell me it's the job saying I, I, I got it. Please. Trial position. Hi, Selena. We hope this email finds you well. The Bureau of Statistics would like to advise you that your interview was successful and offer you a four-week trial position. If your trial is successful, we will offer you a full-time employment. Congratulations to see you on Monday. Shove it in their face. Alrighty. It's quite the um, family we got here. So we got clearance level 10. Hi, I'm Selena. You're on trial? Well, that's me. How was your interview? Uh, pretty weird, especially for the Bureau of Statistics. Bureau? Of Statistics? What are you talking about? Wait, what are you talking about? Oh man, sounds like you're in for a surprise. <laughs> oh, they fooled you with this Bureau of Stuff. No, man, we're looking into people's privacy all the time, apparently. Howdy! My name's Peeper, and I'm the resident artificial intelligence here. Aren't you supposed to be like a paperclip? We are now America's first and best defense against terrorism. In these turbulent times, it has become necessary to watch our citizens much more closely. Okay. As an employee here, your job is to analyze the suspects we send to you. Each day at work, you will have a different assignment. Mm -hmm. Below the objective or the assignment rules, click to have a look. Rules are where we define a suspect as guilty or innocent, suspicious or harmless. Mm -hmm. Each assignment's rules will be different. Be sure to check. Them. So, it's like I mentioned, it's turning into like the entire papers, please, type of thing, which is fine by me. For more details about your assignment, click here on the panel to view the briefing again. Okay, so... Hmm. Black Sheep Tool. V. Ramirez. Code 45. Revelations.org. Now that you know what you're looking for, you need some suspects. Alright, so let's go over here to Florida. Stop moving. Stop moving. We have Harald Benjamin. By the way, people told me Falcon the salary is actually a month. And I was like, oh, okay. Well, that makes sense for some of them. But then I'm thinking I'm like, like a month? That much? For some people? Good God. What am I doing with my life? 
Uh, these will fill up as, f as you find suspicious pieces of evidence on each suspect. One point indicates one suspicious piece of evidence to... Oh, yeah. Two is two and three is three. Imagine that. Now back to evidence. Right. If you see evidence that violates a rule, you use black sheep on it. Alright. Well, everything here seems legit, go. Russo, Gene, Rout, and Morrow. Russo, Gene, Rout, and Morrow. Don't see any of them here. Revelations, all that jazz. Okay, so there was nothing there. Um, but here we go. We go to the browser history. We have Silly Cat Comp... Comp... Compilation? Shouldn't that be like a compilation? Illegal Gun Act Auction. Code 45. And Recipe Easy. Well, I know Code 45 was for a fact down here, right? Yes, sir, it was. So, we use Black Sheep on this one. So, Black Sheep. Selected. There she is. Now, select a rule that applies. Well, it's like Code 45. At this clearance level, you will only find a maximum of one piece of suspicious evidence on any suspect. Alright, so we got the one that we needed. Cool. That means you're ready to t make a decision and use your powers. So let's use the power. This person's a threat. Code 45, no good. Nice, the suspect will now be processed according. Uh-huh. You'll find out in your assignment summary if you made the right decision. Well, I think that was the right decision. Let's move on to the next one, shall we? Yes. Daniela Bianchi. So we have a professional gambler. Lastly, stay off your phone, buddy. You won't need it during missions. Hmm, something tells me at some point we probably will. We have celebs, so you've been watching like the TMZ version of this game. Lingo Peep and Simple True. How to boil an egg in 24 steps, learn Greek online. Maya Grace, barely there dress. Oh, 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 barely there. Well, I don't think there was anything over here, right? But we're looking for V. Ramirez, Nobua, and Barker as well. Ramirez, Nobua, and Barker. Let's check out the comment of data. Nina, nope. This person, at least to me, unless I vibe, I'm, I'm a ding dong and completely miss something, looks pretty legit. Safe. Was that good, Clipper? You're not gonna tell me until later, huh? Okay. Well, we have Edward Zim Zim Zimzak. All right, 57 years old. Okay, come on now. Come on now. I'm, okay, who told me this is a month thing? A janitor makes $18,000 a month? Well, what the hell am I doing with my 18000 Okay, I'm gonna be a janitor now. I could be a janitor. I could clean. Alright, browsing history. Let's see here. Separations, blog, schmog, trupedia. It's like the Wikipedia of the game. Um, revelations code. No, we're good here. I, I imagine at some point they'll probably have like a timer or something I have to worry about. I mean, there's time clicking over there, but I'm not sure if I have to worry about time myself. I think Barker was one of them, right? Yep, G. Barker. Nobua and Ramirez. G. Barker. That's it right there, boys. Bomsky. G. Barker. Mm-hmm. So I got that. Power. My boy, the janitor, making $18,000 a month. He's a threat. I think we should, that should have been like fairly obvious. You're a janitor, you're making $18,000 a month. Yeah, something's up here. Um, we have Blanca Gregoria, 25 years old. Uh, let's see, disturbing content at revelations.org. So that's kind of weird because revelations.org is a black sheep tool, but she didn't go there. She went to a site covering information about it. So should I mark that one? That's a bit kind of like, you know, are you testing me? Hoffman, Mark, Wu, and Jorge. No? So, what do you guys think? This is, um, tricky because... It does... She's reading... It's kind of like if you were going to, if you were going to, like, a CNN or something, to read news about some sort of thing that went down on, you know, YouTube, because some sort of YouTube celebrity did something crazy again. So, you're still looking up YouTube stuff, but... or about the YouTube website, but you're doing it from another website. Does that qualify? I don't know. I'm gonna say no. If we're gonna be literal, I'm gonna say no, it does not qualify. So, safe. I don't know about this one. I feel that one could have gone anyway. And I feel like they purposely did to trick me. We have Jane and Jane. Why don't you just cut one of your names off and just be Jane like Cher? Just one name, it's fine. Circus proprietor, 90,000. Okay, 19 years old. 90,000. It's pretty good money, I gotta tell you. Browsing history. Sometimes skips works, treats people badly, wants to be treated well. Extremely family-oriented and identifies with celebrities. <laughs> um, cash code 45? No, that's cash. See, they want to trick you. This is code 45, and she went to cash code 45. 
Dab Cola. Oh, please, don't tell me it's a cola where you dab on people. Um, so we're looking for Ramirez, Nobua, and Barker. Let's see. Ramirez. We have a V Ramirez, is that it? Yes. Okay. So, excuse me, I gotta... Must mark you for identifying with celebrities, apparently. Ramirez. Got it? Alright, powers. Threat. Then we got everybody. All suspects process submit for review. Hello, I've completed the assignment. Please see my report attached. Good work, buddy. Um... I think we got everything right. Evidence incorrectly marked. Yeah, we got everything right. Cool. So that was a trick after all. Good. Hello, agent. Please find your assignment report attached. Keep up the good work. Finish review. Compliance change. So we got a 13% increase, it does seem. Nice. So from 81, we're at 94 now. 100 bucks. Compliance over 85 gives us a $100 bonus. That's what's up. All right. Not bad for a first day's work and session. Absolutely. All right. That went fairly good. Added to added to two watch list. Remove from suspect pool. Threat level upgraded to mild. This is kind of cool. Like if all the suspected people like continue being part of the story and it's slowly built up to something huge. All right, that looks kind of intriguing. I'm down with that. Great work today, Agent. Thank you. Hell of a first day, huh? Yeah, you could say that. Well, my cousin got hired at the Clearwater branch, and I heard it only gets weirder from here. But hey, at least it's interesting. See you tomorrow. Yeah. Shall indeed see you tomorrow. Validate on boarding, adult fair. Time to head home. <laughs> I love the entire UI of the game. It's, uh, you know, unique. It's not just like a bunch of, like, text on screen. Oh, somebody's calling. Who's calling? I wouldn't pick up if I don't know who's calling, man. It's just me. I screen everything. What can I say? Oh, you want me to decline? All right. Valid on boarding. Or at least she's like me. Don't know the person? I am picking up. If it's that important, you'll leave me a message. Hey, Selena. Am I back for day two or what? Apparently so. All right. Authenticate. New evidence access, um, personnel network, legal authorization, Liberty Act 2019, program name, who me, about this evidence, a sample of a user's personal network calculated by artificial intelligence analysis of activity, provides agents with an overview of a user's associates, collection methods, okay, okay, usually web searches are, in his, are innocuous, but the department likes to keep track of certain keywords, especially those associated with lethal chemicals, Identify searches for these chemicals and any connections with known militants. So let's see what we got here. Ethidium bromide. Bro. Potassium cyanide. Hydrofluoric acid. Chadam. Chadampur and boon. Alright. Let's um, begin our assignment. We're still working out of um, Florida searches, right? Identify. Yeah, yeah, gotcha. Don't forget, you can check your place in the dole by checking on your ID card. All right. Well, let's start off here with um, Christy Ann. Christy Ann. 71 years old. 71-year-old <laughs> magician, huh? How about that? All right, so browsing history. Searching for Ethidium Bromide. Well, that was one of them, all right. Okay. What about the personal network? Boone? Oh, I, see. I know Boone was part of it. D. Boone. And it's searching for Ethidium Bromide. So, can I mark two of them, I guess? I would say so. So, let's go over to... Black Sheep. Boon for a fact. Dar. So, two things wrong. Oh, you're up to some really sketchy stuff, Christiane, looking for Ethidium Bromide online. Yeah, you're a threat. You threaten my safety, ma'am. Okay, that's good. We have Gur... Brienne. Radio DJ, 28,000. Enjoys being on ships, bad memory for numbers, has a brother complex, enjoys smell gifts. Browsing history. Trailers, Jessica 69 live. <laughs> All right, you gotta have a 69 if you're doing some, um, you know, online pornography. Searching for potassium chloride. I believe that was one of them too, right? No, 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 potassium cyanide. Ah, the tricks, the tricks. So that's fine. That's fine. Let's see about your call meta data though. S Park. I mean, who am I looking for? I'm looking for Chandrapur and Boone. I think you're clear. 
I think they're clear. I think the first one was just to throw me off. Hopefully that's right. Here we have Garrett Pataki. 23 years old, grocery stalker. You know, grocery stalker making 17000 a year or a month. As I was led to believe and apparently ruse the entire time about it. Um, make a Garfield lasagna. Searching for a hydrochloric acid. Hydrofluoric. Hydrochloric. Ah, they tried to trick me again. Personal network. And you're looking for a Boone or a Chandapur. You, my friend, seem to be pretty safe. Although I almost marked you because um, the game's trying to trick me now. It's actively trying to ruse the bird. Alan Jane, what do you got for me here? Street entertainer, 34 years old. See your browsing history like. We have Grand Illinois Hotel, Chicago Forest, and to top 10 sites in Chicago. Okay, so it looks like you're make planning a trip to Chicago soon. Has a bird mark on the thigh, obsessed with African art, leaves hair in plug hole. Ugh. Keen astronomer. And for names, we're looking. Oh, Chandrapur. That just stuck out. Yep. So we have at least one. All I have is one for you, though. Everything else, I think, is fine. But you're still a threat. Not like maybe a major threat, but you're still a minor threat. Okay, who do we have left? Ian Nolan. Ian Nolan, 65 years old, training coordinator, 40,000. Rarely takes no for an answer. Oh, I hate people like that. Just take no for an answer, dog. Constantly double checks, can read two pages uh, of a book at once. Wow. Hate shopping malls. I mean, who doesn't, really? All right, call me to data. Let's see here. Bone. No, it's close, but you know, that's got, got an E right there. Not the right bone. So, nobody in the call records, right? No Chandrapur or Boon would only without an E, so you're fine there. But what about your personal network? Chandrapur, I think that's spelled incorrectly, right? Yes, okay. You, my man, are safe. Okay, I think we did fairly well here as well. Let's process it. Three saves, two guilties. What you got for me? We This time, it went a lot faster, too. We had plenty of time to spare for this one. Boom! Everything right again. Ha <laughs> ha! Trying to trick the bird, but it ain't working. Let me get that money, son. Let me get that compliance change, too. Look at that. We should have gone over 100, really. Alright, so 100 bonus yet again. I will definitely take it. Let me check this. Alright, this we're up to 423 now in our savings. End session. Very good. Threat level downgraded to low. Return to suspect pool. Miami branch for threat check. A little Allen check there. Garrett Pataki returned to the suspect pool. Threat level downgraded to low. We had one that was high. Yeah, you. Yeah, you had two. You had two going for you. Something wrong, Selena? Um, it's just one of the profiles belongs. Oh, really? Belongs to a friend. Congratulations, are you getting squeamish? Well, no ma'am. We're in the business of awkward secrets and uncomfortable truths, Knight. No matter how personal or uncomfortable they may be to your fragile sensibilities. Got it? Yes, ma'am. See that you iron that out. Above all, you're here for your country. Hmm. Hmm, <laughs> hmm. That sucks, man. But they'll have a profile in everyone. Apparently, my cousin saw his mom's browsing history once. He didn't realize there were that many Channing Tatum photoshops on the internet. <laughs> Knowing my mom, it'd be something much more practical. Oh, dude, are we gonna find it? We're gonna have to ride out our family at some point, aren't we? If it's any consolation, I don't know if I buy that forgotten country spiel. Sheep Sharp is just like everyone else. She's here for the paycheck and she forgets the job the second she leaves every day. Yeah, you're probably right. Maybe. Alrighty. Well, we done here for today, apparently. Time to head home. May I get that weird call again? No. But we are back home. We got a message from Garrett. Garrett Pataki. Oh, that was the stock boy. But he was fine. Yeah. Chat now. Hey, how are you doing? Wanna hang out tonight? Kinda of snowed under kinda of snowed at under at the moment, sorry. Can't sorry. Maybe a rain check, Garrett, sorry. Uh yeah, we'll hit that one. <laughs> I'm not sure if I wanna be hanging out with people being suspected over here. Especially when I'm trying to get this job. All good. Oh, just one thing. 
Who was your crush in high school again? You just feed off my embarrassment, don't you? Serena Leonard, you know that? Max Leonard, you know that? Oh, okay, so I could go either way. Either way. Hmm, let's go with Serena Leonard. Sure, why not? Oh, I don't think uh, you ever admitted it. Anyway, she's organizing some five-year high school reunion thing. You should think about it. Oh, yeah. More people from my history that are apparently attached to some sort of terrorist act from Francis Lamb. Hey, bud. Hope the new job's going okay. Thanks, appreciate it. Okay, thanks. <laughs> well, that was nice of her. We have a new app installed, too. Insta buy. Oh. Should I be buying this stuff? Banzai in a pod. I could, I could definitely use a new phone. Can I buy a new phone? Let's buy ourselves a new phone finally. How about that? Like, everything here is like, it's kind of like cool maybe, but our phone, dude. Let's buy it. Overnight delivery. I'm gonna wake up with a new phone, boys. Alright. <laughs> and... Better get ready for work. Something we'll probably get it tomorrow, huh? Oh, is it being fixed? Is it being fixed? Do we have a new phone? We have a new phone! Yeah! We're coming up on the world. All right, guys, we're going to wrap it up here. I hope you guys enjoyed it. This is Need to Know. As I mentioned, if you want to see more of this, do let me know in the comments. Something about leaving a thumbs up, and we'll definitely do so. I'm going to be, like, checking this one out more closely than the first one to see if there's, like, you know, interest remaining. I will catch you next time.